Good morning. Welcome to Computer Science Tutorial. In this tutorial, we will learn how to convert hexadecimal number into the decimal number with simple and very easy examples. Let's start. Dear friends, if you don't have to subscribe my channel, subscribe it to get the latest update regarding my channel. Before the starting the conversion process, we must know what is the hexadecimal number and hexadecimal number is a collection of numbers between 0 to 9 digit and A to F alphabet. Remember that any hexadecimal number has digit from 0, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9 and alphabets from A to F, A, B, C, D, E, F. Hexadecimal number has total 16 numbers and alphabets like 0 to 9 10 digits and A to F 6 digits. Therefore, its base is called as 16. In this example here, 5 to 3, whether it is hexadecimal number or not, when I check 5 to 3 exists between the 0 and 9. Therefore, it is a valid hexadecimal digit. Next one. 256 again all the all these digits exist between 0 to 9 therefore it is a valid hexadecimal number 1a 1 exists between 0 to 9 and a exists between a to f therefore it is also valid hexadecimal number again 1a.23 it is also a valid hexadecimal number 45G, 45 exists between 0 to 9, but G, G does not exist between A to F, therefore it is an invalid hexadecimal number. So if you found any number which contain a digit or alphabet outside these range, that number is not a hexadecimal number. So in any exam, if you, if the conversion examples you have found there you must check all the digit of number carefully after checking all these digits you must start the conversion process here i have a hexadecimal number 563 the left digit is called left most significant digit and the right digit is called right most significant digit. Every digit in hexadecimal number has a positional value. The first left hand side digit has a position value 0. As I explained you earlier, the first digit has a positional value 0, then 1, then 2, then 3 and so on. This position value is written into the form of 16 to the power n. 16. What is the 16? 16 is the base of hexadecimal number. If I use the octal number, if I use octal number, the base is 8. If I use binary, the base is 2. And in our example, we are learning the conversion process from hexadecimal to decimal. Therefore, I use the base 16. And n is the positional value. And this is called the weight of hexadecimal digit. For example, our number is 523. The left digit has a position 0. Therefore, its weight is called 16 to the power 0. Next digit has the weight 1. So, we can represent it 16 to the power 1. And the rightmost digit has the weight 16 to the power 2. This weight is used to calculate the decimal value of any hexadecimal number. Now we will learn the conversion process. I have taken a very simple example. Our number is 2114 base 16. It means this is our hexadecimal number and I want to convert this hexadecimal number into the decimal number. So our number is 2114. So I have write the weight of 
hexadecimal number here like 16 to the power 0 16 to the, 16 to the power 1 16 to the power 2 and 16 to the power 3 the left most digit is 0 therefore its weight is 16 to the power 0 next digit is 4 the base is 16 to the power 1 next is 1 16 to the power 2 and last right more digit is 2 the base is 16 to the power 3 as I explained you earlier our number is 2140 as I give you into the example 2140 therefore I first write the base of these numbers here after this we have to multiply the digit and its weight for example 16 to the power 0 multiplied by 0 16 to the power 1 multiplied by 4 16 to the power 2 multiplied by 1 16 to the power 3 multiplied by 2 after this we have to resolve the power 16 to the power 0 is equals to 1 and 1 into 0 which is equals to 0 so I write 16 to the power equals to 1 here 1 into 0 16 to the power 1 is equals to 16 16 into 4 16 to the power 2 is equal to 256 16 to the power 3 equals to 4096 multiplied by 2 after this I multiply this 1 into 0 0 16 multiplied by 4 which is equal to 64 256 multiplied by 1 256 and 4096 multiplied by 2 equals to 8192 after that we have to calculate the sum of all these numbers 0 plus 64 plus 256 plus 8192 it return 8512 this is our decimal value of 2112140 hexadecimal number so our answer is or when we convert 2140 hexadecimal number into decimal number it returned 8512 case 2 in second case we have a hexadecimal number into the decimal notations first we have to check whether the digit is correct or not we have seen all digit exist between 0 to 9 so it is a valid hexadecimal number after checking digit we have to start the conversion process the conversion process is divided into two parts the conversion of digit before the decimal places and the conversion process conversion of digit after the decimal places let's start hexadecimal number before the decimal places so our number is 1 to 1 the base of the weight of 1 is 16 to the power 0 the weight of 2 is 16 to the power 1 and the weight of 1 is 16 to the power 2 after that we have to multiply weight and digit weight and digit 16 to the power 2 into 1 after this we have to calculate or resolve the powers or simplify the powers 16 to the power 0 it return 1 1 into 1 16 into 2 and 256 into 1 after this we have to multiply 1 into 1 1 16 multiplied by 2 32 and 256 multiplied by 1 256 after this we have to calculate the sum of all three numbers 1 plus 32 plus 256 it will run 289 this is the conversion process of hexadecimal number before the decimal place similar we have to calculate or convert hexadecimal number after the decimal places our number is 201 dear friends you have to remember that any digit which appear after the decimal places has the weight into the minus format for example the first digit 2 which appear after the decimal places has the weight 16 to the power minus 1 
similar zero has the weight 16 to the power minus 2 and one has the weight 16 to the power minus 3 after this we have to multiply weight and digit 16 to the power minus 1 multiply by 2 similar 16 to the power minus 2 multiply by 0 similar 16 to the power minus 3 multiply by 1 After this, we have to simplify this. We can write 16 to the power minus 1 as 1 upon 16. So I write 1 upon 16 multiplied by 2. Similar, I write 16 to the power uh, after multiplication it return 0. After this, 16 to the power minus 3 it return 1 upon 4096 multiplied by 1. After this, we have to sim simplify it. It return point six two five. It return zero. And when I divide one by four zero nine six, it return point zero 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 two double four multiplied by. After this, we have to multiply this number and this number separately and calculate the sum of both number. It return point one two five two double four. So our answer is two eight nine point one two five two double four. So friends, the conversion process is very simple. You have to calculate or convert first hexadecimal number which appear before the decimal places. After that, you have to convert hexadecimal number which appear after the decimal places and write both number together. so this is exercise for you you have to calculate the decimal value of the following hexadecimal number first number is 591 base 16 second number is abc base 16 and third number is 501.141 base 16 dear friends solve these questions and write your answer into the comment sections So in this video we have learned how to convert an hexadecimal number into the decimal number we have taken two type of case simple hexadecimal number and hexadecimal number with decimal notation if you like this video subscribe to my channel share this video on facebook twitter blogger if you have any query you can write your question into the comment section or you can contact me by my email address or mobile number thank you for watching my video